So you want to set one inch margins in your Microsoft Word document. The method that I'm going to show you will work for whatever size margins you want, whether they be one inch, 1.25 inch or one and a half inch. You may also want to set up your margins using centimeters. And we'll look at the equivalent centimeter values for one inch margins, 1.5 inch margins, etc. Now your first step is to see which measurement unit Word is currently using. And to do that, you go to the file tab on your ribbon, go down to options, at the bottom left there, and then down the side here, click on advanced and then scroll down until you see the display section. And there's an option here, show measurements in units of, and you can see that currently Microsoft Word on my PC is using centimeters. Now I'm going to change that to inches and then click on OK. And you'll see now that the ruler at the top of my document is showing measurements in inches rather than centimeters. Now to change the actual margins, what you do is you go to the layout tab on your ribbon then go to the margins button. And then there's a list of margin settings that you can apply. And also you can specify custom margins. Now on my PC, if I go for normal, it will give me margins top, bottom, left and right of one inch. If you can't see that, go to custom margins. And what you can do is specify your margin settings in each of these boxes. So my top margin wants to be one inch, left margin one inch, bottom margin one inch, right margin one inch. If I click on OK, it applies those margin settings to my document. Now, obviously, if you wanted one and a half inch margins, you'd go back to your margins button, go down to custom margins, and you change the margin settings to 1.5. And then click on OK. Now, if you want to know what the centimeter equivalent of 1.5 inches is, then all you need to do is go back to File, Options, Advanced, go back down to your display settings and change this setting here, show measurements in units of, back to centimeters. Click on OK. And then if I went to Margins, custom margins, I'd see the centimeter equivalent of 1.5 inches, which is 3.81 centimeters. Okay, that's all I wanted to cover on this particular video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see you next video.